Um, you know, I, I just want to follow up and agree with the speaker that, you know, we agree with the president, we can't wait. Uh, and we have said all along that we can't wait uh, to try and resolve the major differences that we have between the two sides on tax increases uh, and the like. But we can put those differences aside and work together on the things that can help job creation in this economy. As the speaker indicated, we're bringing up this week a bill that is within the president's plan. It's a bill to help uh, uh, governments and their contractors at all levels uh, to do things in a more efficient way so that we ensure that prices don't go up. Uh, and that's what the 3% withholding bill actually does. And we're hopeful that the President will join us because this is a provision in his, in, in his bill uh, and we have used a mechanism and a pay for that he has embraced. Uh, there's no reason why this bill shouldn't pass. We, we agree with the President. We shouldn't and we can't wait. Uh, I think on a broader note, you know, when I was at home in my district last week, I visited uh, the biotech park in Richmond. And what we saw there were young entrepreneurs uh, really growing week over week uh, in terms of expanding their businesses. It is the startup businesses and the entrepreneurs that we can't wait to help. Uh, and that's what we're trying to do. We want to work with the other side to do so, setting aside the differences uh, that seem to continue to dominate uh, in this town. Thank you.